pharmaceutical giant AstraZeneca is facing twin challenges in Europe over efficacy and delivery. On Monday, a German daily reported that Berlin was unhappy with AstraZeneca's COVID vaccine. The report said that the jab was only 8% effective among people aged 65 plus, but the company has rejected these claims. It cited data published in The Lancet, which showed adequate immune response in older adults. Asked about these reports, the German health minister said he would respond only after reviewing the complete trial data. The European Union is expected to approve AstraZeneca's COVID vaccine later this week. German media reports indicate that Berlin does not expect the jab to get approval for use among the elderly. Last Friday, AstraZeneca informed the EU of a delay in vaccine deliveries. This has frustrated the EU leadership, who cite the company's contractual obligations. In August last year, the bloc signed a deal for 300 million doses. 80 million of them were expected to be delivered by March. But the company says it will be unable to meet its commitments. Combined with the delays announced by Pfizer, the EU's vaccination drive is at risk of stalling. In a tense phone call with AstraZeneca's chief executive, the EU leader, Ursula von der Leyen, urged the company to deliver on its promise. The European Union wants to know exactly which doses have been produced where by AstraZeneca so far and if or to whom they have been delivered. These questions were also discussed today in the Joint Steering Board of the Commission and the 27 member states with AstraZeneca. The answers of the company have not been satisfactory so far. And that's why a second meeting is scheduled for tonight. In response, the EU is threatening to block AstraZeneca's exports. The bloc's leadership plans to ask pharma companies to notify them before exporting to third countries. While these curbs will not impact humanitarian exports, they will hamper AstraZeneca's ability to fulfill its obligations outside the bloc, including in the United Kingdom. We want clarity on transactions and full transparency concerning the export of vaccines from the EU. In the future, all companies producing vaccines against COVID-19 in the EU will have to provide early notification whenever they want to export vaccines to third countries. Humanitarian deliveries are, of course, not affected by this. The European Union will take any action required to protect its citizens and rights.